Hey y'all, welcome back. I got my shorty back here today. I'ma pluck her. I'ma show y'all how I pluck the hair. But I just want y'all to know I'm still learning. I use this to um hold the hair back. Hold on, put this down some. Okay, but yeah, I use that to all the hair back and my hot comb to do that too. I feel like this puts it all the way, all the way back though. The this thing. Mm -mm. Okay, cool. So what I'm gonna do here is you get you this thing, slick stick to slick that thing back. And then you want to get your comb, if I can find it, a comb, and your tweezers, if I can find my tweezers. I need to get an organizer for my thing because it's really annoying. And a tweezers. So, what we're going to do here is we're going to slick show me back. Yeah, I haven't been posting for my vlogmas. I'm playing around too much, but I haven't been posting because... I had to restock my lip gloss. And let me tell y'all, making lip gloss is not a easy process. Okay? It's not, like, it's easy. Making lip gloss now, to me, is easy because I've been making it for, for a minute now. But it's just very time consuming. And it's a lot of work. Like, making the lip gloss itself is not a lot of work. But I gotta make the lip gloss. When I'm stirring that thing, my hand be hurting. I gotta make the lip gloss. No, first I gotta clean the tubes. Clean and dry the tubes. Let me continue. I gotta clean and dry the tubes. And then clean and dry the tubes and the um the tubes, the top that you think, and then the little stopper. I gotta clean all those separately. Clean and dry all those. Um Clean and dry the tubes. Then I gotta make the lip gloss. Right. Then I have to. Okay, so look, I put I put this. Oh, my bad, y'all. I was getting a call, but um, I put that thing on and then I just oop, stick the hairs back with the hot comb. But yeah, like I was saying, um, I have to clean the lip gloss. Then I have to make the lip gloss, and then I have to. Why is this burning like that? Clean the lip gloss. Hold on. Because I don't need that fire alarm going off. You did. <laughs> we just going to put her down. So why she burning like that? But, um, so yeah. Uh, what I do? What I was talking about? Make the lip gloss. I gotta take a syringe, put it in each and every tube, and then I gotta top every tube, and then I gotta put the lip gloss in every tube. Then I have to put the labels under every tube, and then put the lip gloss in a box, and then label every box. It's just a lot. So I've been doing that. I ain't really have time for my videos. It's like I'm lost. I'm thinking about too much stuff right now. But yeah, that's what I do with my lip gloss. It's, it's very time consuming. But so yeah, so now what you want to do is you want to um take some pieces of the baby hair out in the in the front. I like to do it in a zigzag and, um, so it can look more natural, I guess. And then... Take it out and then I just do this so that it, none of those hairs could come back over there. Right? And then just start plugging. You feel me? But don't be going crazy now, though. You don't want to make no holes. I used to be making holes in this thing. You don't want to make no holes. Some people be like, you know, take your time. Do it nice and soft. You know what? 
I just be doing it crazy. Like, don't do it crazy, like, but like, you know, you feel me? Sign like this. Oh, hold on. Let me show you for real. Show you for real, for real. Something like that. Let me see if I can zoom in on that thing. Cause I'm trying to show you for real, for real. I can't zoom in, but zoom in on your phone. I think you could do that. Or if you're watching on the on your TV, just get close to the TV. Okay, look. See how I'm doing that? Just thing it, you feel me? But don't go crazy though, you feel me? Just do a couple. And then brush the excess, the hair out. And then again, split it again, right? Hold this hair real, real good. I would say use the flat part of the tweezers. And don't do it like right next to each other do it like spaced out to look more natural you've been i'll be doing it little by little you don't have to do it like this but i'll be doing it like this right and then you brush her back get all that hair off and then do it again you could do this like the parts you see how i'm parting it like this i guess part it four times or however many you think however many you think is valid then put that hook very very good and then you keep doing that oh my goodness i should have brushed her look and then you keep doing that all around. I feel like you could like just check and see how it's looking. You see that? Okay. But I'm gonna do all around real quick. Okay, so when you're done, you want to um, push her back again with the hot comb so you can see, so it can give you a better look of how it's looking. If you don't like how it looks, you can just always pluck more, but don't be plucking too much now because you can't put that hair back on. So, I think she's looking pretty good. Oh, hold on. There we go. What y'all think? You think I should pluck, pluck them off? I don't know. I don't be knowing. I be asking my boyfriend. I think he just be saying yeah just to say yeah because he don't know either. But I think this valid. Think that's valid? I'm going to pluck the front a little bit. What you could do is... I saw this on TikTok. I don't know. I saw this on TikTok, but it's my first time doing this. So, we gonna see. <laughs> I don't even know if I'm messing it up, but shawty, we gonna have to see. I guess, like, take pieces off. Like, instead of t doing it like this, ch ch do it like this. The long way. You see? Like, Instead of doing it like this, do a little bit the long way. We gonna see how that make it look though. This is without the hair being um, without the hair being parted back way. too much I don't think you want to do too much because you don't want to look crazy I'm 
burning. And then brush her out real good. Get all that hair out. This is a really good wig though. I got this wig from Gita Hair. And yeah. I think it's valid. You think it's valid? I think. <laughs> and then the front. Shoot, I think it's valid. I don't even know. I don't even be knowing. Look at the side. But, uh, yeah, that's it. That's how I do it. If you feel like it needs to be plugged more, then go ahead. I'm going to plug a little more. Matter of fact, I'm going to leave her like that because I don't want to violate. I'm going to leave her like that. I'll just take some at the top a little more. I don't want to bowl the top of any. I think that's valid because I don't want to overdo it and then mess my thing up. So, yeah, that's it, y'all. That's how I pluck my hair. This hair is so cute, though. This hair is from Get A Hair Company. I'm going to put it in the link below. And if you want to see me bleaching this hair, I'm going to put that video in the link below too. Yeah, I think it's better, right? It is, right? You think? I don't even know sometimes. Do you think this side needs to do more? <laughs> I don't know. I think this side does need to do a little more. No, right? I don't know, Shelly. I think this side is valid though. But I'm going to do a video installing this wig next. So stay tuned for that. And yeah, I love y'all. I'm going to try to do, I'm trying, I'm going to try to catch up with my vlogmas since I was making my lip gloss and stuff. But I'll probably post the other one of me doing that right after. Well, not right after, but a little bit after. And then this is all the hair I got off the plucking. Bye, y'all. Love y'all. See y'all later.